This is a very beautiful traditional Dayak dance. They waved while holding dance equipment. Dayak is a tribe that inhabits the island of Borneo. They live in several countries, such as in Indonesia and Malaysia. They stick to the customs even in any activity. Not even rarely seen in government and religious activities. Today, we see various cities that are advancing in Kalimantan. Now, we are in the city of Balikpan. This is a city close to the new capital of Indonesia. Kalimantan is rich in natural resources. Thousands of bird species exist on this island. The vast forest is home to various types of animals. Kalimantan's forests store a variety of plants that are not found elsewhere. Various types of plants recently found in this place. Some of them are endemic plants that are not found anywhere else. Several cities in Kalimantan are already getting crowded. This is closely related to the transfer to the new capital of Indonesia. The situation has changed compared to a few years ago. People from outside the island began to come to this place in search of a new life. It can be seen from the increasingly crowded city highways. Vehicles outside the area appear to fill the city highway area. This also indicates that the regional economy is growing rapidly. Marine wealth is also an added value for this area. Kalimantan's oceans are rich in natural resources. Plus sea lanes that are used as international routes. Economic movement is very large on this island, even the largest in Indonesia. This is the mining equipment that so when he found in this island. This is a road project to the new capital of Indonesia, namely the new Santara. This mega project is currently underway and will be completed in the next few years. Starting in 2024, the government will begin to be transferred gradually. Kalimantan will be more advanced and have international-level cities 